Black, Black King is Bush here with one of my one of our good friends in this high school basketball business here. Mr. Johnny Mosco came up here and got a tough win in it. This is my first time here, John. Yes. Uh, it's an impressive home environment for Devin Prep. That yes. little 30, 40 man student section makes a lot of noise. They did. It was a great, you know, it's a Catholic League road win. Yeah, it really. Tough is. environment. Good environment, great environment. Kids were were loud for them, and you know, really senior loud. night. Yes. yes. Well, you guys came in here, and early on, it just seemed to me that you guys were really communicating, trying to stay attached. You know, Devin Prep kind of waits to lull people to sleep. Wake, you made a mistake. Go back door, get open three, and none of it. I mean, they had two points yeah. at the end of the first quarter. Was that the game plan going and just yes. be patient? Be patient. Don't gamble, stay attached to the shooters, make them finishers at the rim. You know, that's how we did it a lot last year, but we had, you know, four Division One players that got antsy and would always reach and they would score, but we stayed in front of them tonight in the beginning for the most part. You're not going to shut them out, and, you know, they, mm -hmm. we were able to stay attached to the shooters and they adjusted. And they started running some slip plays and some ball screens and dribble handoffs. All right. John, being, being so young um, and playing two very different styles in back to back <laughs> in the same week, Rome and you know the the, the you know the, the the tradition, and then you got Devin and Upstart running a crazy day. offense, and yeah, one day preparation. How did you get the young guys? What was the key for the young guys? You know what you're going to get from Justin. You know what you're yeah. going to get from the big fella. But those young wings you have. Yeah, Justin was big at that. He talked, communicated in practice. You know, I've been on him since we he came over. When he decides he wants to practice, we have better practices. And he was communicating in practice, listening what we wanted to do, the game plan. You know, we wanted to play our pace and communicate on defense. And he, you know, he started it with, you know, guarding the ball, playing off, you know, doing what we asked to do. And, you know, the other guys just followed him as usual, except at the end when he got a stupid foul. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you have had some really good point guards come through here. You know, going back to Tommy Funk, and you got Colin, you got Sue. Am I missing somebody? Funk, Sue, Colin. Now you pick up Justin. You only got him for one year, though. We got lucky. <laughs> <laughs> How thanks, does he fit thanks, into the you? Size. He, he goes at a faster pace than yeah, the guys you. Go. Yeah, he, he likes to go. Um, he likes to shoot his pull up. Like even still now, I think he's being a lot of unselfish, where he can get his own shot and he's getting guys involved. Mm -hmm. But the Roman game, every time we needed an answer, he could hit a big shot for us. You know, tonight, you know, he knew when to take the ball to the basket, fake a dribble handoff, went and finished a couple layups, got fouled, got to the foul line. He's just he knows when to take over. He's starting to be a little more like Colin at that. That's what we preached to him all summer. You don't need to get 20 in the first half. You need to finish the game with 20, 25, get six to eight assists, and that's what he's doing. You know, he's playing at good pace, and he's defending, which, you know, helps. Well, speaking of Roman, since you knocked him off, you got to look like you woke up a giant. They they beat Ryan by, I think, 132 tonight. Man. Yeah, I think I got a dinner coming. For <laughs> but, you know, we'll see. Um, yeah, I mean, but it, it's the Catholic League. Mm -hmm. I've been saying it all summer. I said it to RC a few times. I said it to you. If somebody calls you on a Friday night and said Devin beat Wood or, or Judge beat not West, surprised. or whatever, it's, I'm not surprised because the league is so tough right now and so together. They're, you know, you've been following yeah. it. It was always Roman. And then, it was all in Newman. And then yeah. Newman started yeah. coming. Yeah. Like, but when you yeah. played, it was always yeah. Roman, yeah. and then it would be somebody else. But yeah. then it was Roman, Newman, Roman, Newman. And then, you know, we took – we got – Good. We got lucky. I got lucky. I had Tommy Funk. I mm -hmm. had yeah, some Andrew really good players. Funk. Right, through. right. And then I got some good players to come. Tyree Pickron, Seth Pickney. You know, and then I developed Colin Gillespie. <laughs> 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 you know, I prayed. It's, it's funny. It's funny you say that about the league. Anybody can beat anybody. Um, do you think that this is a year where we're going to see somebody? And be real. I mean, yeah. we're, we're, this yeah. is Black Cage Sports. No, like, I know. Do you think you're going to see somebody that hasn't been to that Palestra? place? Show yes. up. Yes. Yeah. I mean, I could. 
I mean, if somebody put a gun to my head, I can't pick four guys that's going to be at the Palestra. I don't you know. You couldn't get all can. four right. Right. I mean, my. I mean, I still don't think they're dead. But my favorite was LaSalle was second. Mm. They have a lot of guys coming back. They could turn it on and get it together. You know, you only have to. You know, you get to the playoffs. You're played a four or five game or, you know. Three six game. Yeah, anybody, anybody? I don't. I won't want to be in any of those spots. When is the last day for free agency? When is the deadline? It was the waiver wire closed in the Catholic League. What's going uh, on, man? <laughs> I don't know nothing about that. I don't know anything about free agency. I know. I, I know. I'm getting hammered tonight. My phone is blowing up. Uh, yes, I did say it was Newman West, and then a bunch of teams mixed up. Um, I'm proud that Roman got a big win tonight, but this Catholic League is going to be a bear. We have some really good teams. and.